Hey guys, what's going on? Listen, just announced the first ever Freedom Factory Drift Event, the inaugural Drift Event since we took over and I'm super excited, but here's the deal. If you go on to buy a ticket to be a drifter at the Freedom Factory Drift Event, you have to enter in your information on what your car is. And I'm not gonna deny anyone who has a drift car. The only reason we did that is because we didn't want uh, people to enter in a bone stock ram 1500 with an open diff so no offense to those dudes i'm just using that as an example i'm just trying to prevent lame drifting from happening on the official first ever drift night so talk to my boys you know like adam lz taylor ray those dudes we're gonna get them out it's march 5th the driver's tech cards are first come first serve we opened up the 10 those sold out and then uh there's 15 other tickets that we added today and there was already drivers approved for that and then we're gonna do the third round tonight. So, so this is important to note, you may get approved to buy a tech card, but the tech cards could still be sold out. So we've approved some guys and then they didn't buy a tech card. So we have to continue to approve other drivers and it's first come first serve. So if you're approved and you don't buy the tech card online, if it already says sold out, they're gone and you cannot drift in the March 5th event. But if you're approved and you're able to buy a tech card, you're good to go. So I don't want that to be mixed up that if someone gets approved and then shows up day of, you have to have already purchased your tech card online before you show up to March 5th, the day of the drift night. Cause I don't want to do, you know, more than like 40 cars for the first one, because then it's just going to be a freaking just disaster. You know, I want everyone to get a bunch of driving in, everyone to enjoy it i don't want to have a huge mess in the pit so we're doing about 40 cars and then i also talked to pat which you guys have seen pat on adam lz's channel he runs drift events that i've been to around the country and he's going to be helping out doing the tech and running the event just because i don't know a lot about running a drift event i've participated in a few so i know a little bit so i figured we'd just hire in a pro for this one and then we'll also you know have an adam and taylor and some of these other pro drift guys who are coming they're gonna know the deal so we'll get it ironed out but if you guys want to be a spectator you know we're gonna have food good music and some crazy driving i'm sure we're gonna end up just destroying all of my cars because i'm gonna send it i'm gonna be drifting the hell out of what i got so march 5th at the freedom factory it's wide open this is gonna put people in the bleachers for the first time we had the car show a lot of people were just you know we're enjoying the car show now we want to put a a couple thousand people in the seats see how the flow changes all that stuff we got the wall patch coming in so that'll be done before then but march 5th is coming up so if you guys want to come out to the first ever freedom factory drift event can't wait to do some tandems with the boys at the freedom factory and uh just have a bunch of people out and have a blast so if you want your tickets guys grab them at the link in the description below or it's just thefoat.com it's a ticketing service that we decided to use for the ff super simple it's nice because you get your ticket they give you a digital ticket you just screenshot it in your email and then uh when you pull up to the gate all we do is scan it and you're in it's super simple easy clean and i'm just fired up man this is the second event the freedom factory this could be a good warm-up for the freedom 500 increasing cars so that's it we'll see you guys march 5th we're going drifting and tickets for these cars and the freedom 500 will be on sale beginning of March, so that's coming too.